Hi, my name is Lester Power with Genesis Medical. Today I'm going to be providing you an in-service on the operational aspects of the Venturi negative pressure systems. This particular model is the Venturi Compact. It's our more portable, ambulatory friendly negative pressure device. The other system is the Venturi Avante, but they both operate the same way. First thing I'll point you to is on the side, remove this black panel and this is where you're going to actually plug in the power supply. There are two ports. One is data, one is 12 volt. Make sure you plug it into the 12 volt which is the bottom. Once you have it plugged in to turn the actual unit on simply depress the power key for a couple of moments. You'll hear an audible alarm and it should come on in standby. The default setting is 80 millimeters of mercury, continuous therapy. To change it, simply hit the up or down button and you can modify your settings in increments of five. I'm going to go ahead and put it on 125 millimeters of mercury. To take it from standby to the operational, simply hit your power button one more time. You'll hear an audible alarm and your pump will go into continuous at 125 millimeters of mercury. To turn it off or put it back into standby, simply hit the power button. You'll hear an audible beep and we're back on the standby. You'll notice hash marks underneath where it says standby or run. That just indicates how fully charged your battery is. Fully charged battery and if we have a proper seal, the battery life is right around 24 hours. We do have a mute button. We have four alarms on the Venturi systems. By depressing the mute button, it will silence the alarm. It won't rectify the problem, but it will silence the alarm. The four alarms are low vacuum, canister full, low battery, or an occlusion in the tubing. Our next button, we have a solid line and dash lines. That is your therapy mode. It can either be continuous or in intermittent. Simply depress that button and now the pump is on intermittent. That simply means that we will run it for 125 millimeters of mercury for seven minutes and then it releases to zero for two. And then seven more minutes at 125 millimeters of mercury releases it for two. To change it back to continuous Simply hit the button. And now we're back on continuous. The Venturis, both the Avanti and the Compact, have a automatic lockout feature. Within two minutes, the unit will go into a lockout mode where you can't make any user modifications. A L will appear on the screen indicating that it is in lockout mode. To make any kind of modifications, you must first unlock it. Simply depress the lock button for two to three seconds. You'll hear an audible alarm and then you'll be able to make your user modifications. The canister is located on the back on the Venturi Compact. The canister is 300 cc's. On the bigger size we have a 600 cc canister. To remove the canister Simply spin your dial counterclockwise and pull the canister away from the unit. When replacing it, simply attach it to the back of the unit, rotate your knob, and we now have our canister secure. Connection tubing, the placement simply goes down into the opening of the canister and twist. At the end of the tubing we have our Christmas tree adapter that simply is going to be where you plug in the tubing from the canister to the drain coming from the wound site. Canister tubing should be replaced every time you replace the canister. Thank you very much.